Hello everybody and welcome to another vlog and today we are again at Zurich one of the most beautiful places in Malta and as you can see here, here there's Filfla and if we go up here it's Jinin and Jibium today I have in mind to go all the way again to the sea and there's a, po uh, a place called El Blia I uh, hope I can get down because from what I seen, I seen from the Malta Climbing Club, and uh, I'm not sure if I have to climb down or I just can go down safely. So, as always, we will go down and uh, safety first, and then I decide what to do. So what I do now, I switch on my uh, my Zolio device, so that if no reception, I can contact Sharon or emergency services. And I start, I can start going down. All my way today will be downhill until I reach my location because I have to go to Levin from up here. And I'm going down slowly. Here I'm passing by a large quarry. Let me show you. It's a big way down here. You can see Phil Flora. And we are going down this part. We're going down from here. Behind there, there's the uh, Ejnin, Ejibune. So we're going downhill. And like this, hopefully, at the end, I will end the vlog by the sea. And you are spared from hearing me puffing a lot eh, today. I have to thank uh, Jason Malia from JM Motors at Army. I will put a caption about uh, his business that uh, as an appreciation for my videos, which uh, it left me uh, really surprised and really happy. He decided to start sponsoring my videos. If you are looking for a second hand car, I will pop up the link and uh, even in the description, go to visit him. He's very helpful and if you buy, don't buy from him, he will not take any offense. He's a nice guy. And tell him that I send them, eh? because like this, it's my thank you for him. Eh? Now I have reached uh, this yellow gate. Remember, I'm following the instructions from Malta Climbing Club, eh, which I thank a lot. Eh. I should start going down from here, eh, down this small road. Uh, they have a, a very good PDF about this place. And uh, those people who like uh, climbing, uh, they have the routes and uh, a lot of stuff. I'd be amazed how good work uh, there was. I'm going down this small road, look how nice it is. People going hiking, take plenty of water, a hat, sunglasses, and uh, wrap some, some uh, protection. Eh? This is uh, a carib tree, a Maldives is Haru Paradise, which will turn brown. And they can do like uh, honey with them, it's very good. I forgot the real name of it, but I'm enjoying this hike. Eh? Here I started my way down. Eh? I'm losing more elevation. Eh? Look how nice this area is. Eh? There's the quarry there, but uh, on the whole, it's a very beautiful place. Eh? And here, eh? up there, is El Munar, it's called. That's with the Zuri, there's the tower with the Zuri. Eh? It's very nice eh? here. Here are some blocks are closing this area off and I think now we are on top of the cliffs, I think, yeah, on the edge of the cliffs. Let's see if I can find a way to go down from here and hope I am in the wrong, in the right direction as well. But look how beautiful there it is. It's amazing, yeah, yeah. From what I can see, I can pass from this place or here, taking great care here because we are on the edge of the cliffs again. Eh? But look how beautiful this area is, I've never been here. Here I should find either some steps or a path that I can go down. Eh? We are very high up, but I keep pushing here 
Und sie, was hat keinen Fall. For the view alone here. It's already worth it, yeah. But let me check the map again to see from where I have to pass. But I decided to continue a little bit on this ledge. Maybe I find somewhere where I can go down. Remember, I don't know the area so well. But I should be looking for some kind of concrete stairs, but I cannot find them. But the view from here of all you are. It's very, very nice. Eh? I'm making my way down uh, slowly because here it's very steep. And I'm trying to find the best way to go down. Eh? But I think the best way to do is to remove cover uh, now so I have more hands on. Eh? I'm still walking on this side. Uh, Although, I'm not sure if I am in the right direction because here, everywhere is cliffs. Eh? But I will try to make my way to the edge and see from where I can move. Eh? I'm still moving this part. Eh? I am on the ledge here, so I'm going to take great care. Here I'm on this ledge, as I told you. That piece of water there is called Tilblia, but look how nice it is here. Eh? You have a great uh, view of Munar from here. There's this real, there's feel free there. But I don't think I can pass from here. Eh? I think something more on that side, but I cannot find a way to go down. Eh? So let's continue. But here for sure it's too much steep. So I will make my way again up around here and go to the other side. Eh? Maybe I find a way. Just in case I came to check here again. Or But, as I was telling you before, I have to go all the way on the other side. Maybe I find a way. But here you have to take great care. Although it's not so fragile where, where I'm walking, you still have to take great care. Because in case of you fall down, you don't stop. It's a very dangerous situation. I'm climbing back up, I start a little bit steep and one has to take great care of it. one puts his feet because one can easily fall down from here. I'm going back from where I started. Maybe I found I find a way uh, to go down eh? because from here I was not in the right position. Now I don't have the camera again and some uh, let me tell no, it's okay. I'm still going up with the glyph face, eh? Yeah. Because if I show you, it's very high, yeah? And one have to take great care. I am on top of the cliffs again, uh, and I will start searching on the other side. Eh? Maybe I find a way how I can go down. But I don't think it's straightforward, as I thought. Maybe I have to walk a little bit on that side. Uh, that's the road that I came for. I went down there, I couldn't find a way down. And now I am on this side. Let's check this side out. Let's find the way down. I'm still going down with this edge. I'm trying to find. The easiest way in, also, yeah. oh, the easiest down. But we're taking great care. This is how hard it is to go down. Eh? Maybe because I don't know my way. Maybe there's an even uh, more easy path eh, going down here. I don't know if you can see, that's a Lutzu, I'm 
traditional Maltese fishing vessel. This is how I'm going down. It's very steep. So one has to take great care. You see. We are losing some height again. And like this is not so difficult to go from this part. I made it down here on this ledge and now I'm trying to find a way where I can go down there but it's proven to be very hard. Let's try to move a little bit near the edge. Ah, there are some steps here. I think this is the part man. Because you see here there are steps. Here I found some steps and they are very steep so you have to take great care so not to slip but they are better than nothing. That is the target destination around here I can see some steps eh? so I think my way is going to be find a way to go down there like this and then continue down there. Eh? So let's try slowly and find the safest place that I can to go down. Going down here is very steep and one has to take great care and if needed use your hands as well. And I try to stay as much as away from the ledge. So if I fall, I have plenty of room. Eh? So now I have to go down there uh, and there are the steps there. This part here proved to be very hard eh? and even navigation is not that easy to go down here. From up there and that's not the upper ledge, I made it to these concrete steps now and I will go down slowly and try to find a way to continue going down eh? along this ledge. As I told you, it's very uh, hard the navigation and you have to to use your skills to avoid danger eh? and do it slowly but here look there's like a small path which will take me there and then I hope I can find another path to continue down eh? because I still have plenty of meters to go I went down from here like this here is the dead end and I will try to climb up here and continue this path eh? Let's see where it takes me. Well, here it looks we find another path. We are down under those cliffs. And hope this time I will find a path going down. I will continue making my way like this. And I think finally I found eh, the, the path. Let me show you where it looks like this. I found the pattern. It's very hidden, very difficult, but very rewarding. Yeah, this spot here. It's really amazing. I was nearly going to start going back yeah, because I couldn't find a decent road to go down here and well done to the Malta Climbing Club for the directions yeah. I did a mistake at first here finally I can walk uh, not in very steep terrain it's not that difficult this part and there is our location yeah. so I can say I'm nearly there it's very amazing here. And I don't think that many people come here apart from people who used to be from Zuria. And as youngsters, they used to come to these places. But look how nice. And for those people who like wall climbing, this is their playground, yeah? and I say them 
they are amazing eh, that they can go up with these walls. They have a, a talent eh, because you need to be very strong, very focused uh, and push on. Eh. And this place here, we have reached El Blia. It's really amazing place. Eh? Look how beautiful it is here. Uh, with this here was. Uh, and what seemed impossible with some perseverance and thought and some research, we find our way. Eh? Now that we reach this area, I can show you a little bit how nice it is here. Eh? And I've been seeing many photos of this area here, eh? but I never thought and I never knew from where I can pass from here. Eh? And going here is not that easy. So people coming here, keep in mind that you'll be walking on ledges and edges of cliffs. Eh? There's a be beautiful uh, view of El Munara up there. But look how amazing this place is. Eh? But there are this is where from here, if you from here, you don't even know from where I came. Eh? A really amazing place here. Yeah? Hope you enjoyed this vlog. It was a little bit difficult. Here at Talblia. Unfortunately, unfortunately, unfortunately. Fortunately, I have my Zolio, and unfortunately, I just received received a message on this because I don't have reception here that my mom had a small accident and needs to go to hospital. So I will stop my vlog here, although I reach my location and start scrambling up as fast as I can and go to with her to hospital for some stitches. Eh? She doesn't have anything big, but I I need to go. So until next time. Bye bye. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and my uh, Instagram on PR4 Jamalta. Until next time, bye bye.